Morning, welcome along. It's Thursday the 14th of January 2020. Our uh, big Asda's coming today. Yep, big Asda shop. And then Tuesday, I know Tuesday seems miles away, our Iceland shopping will be turning up. Uh, between it, I've spent, get this, £174. But that is for a month. So there's plenty, plenty there. You can't say I haven't ordered enough food. Well, today was a, an experience, as normal. The wheelchair lady turned up with a new seat. Only thing that I can describe this blow-up seat as is a load of cones that you have to fill up to a certain air pressure, then let it down to about a centimetre and a half, then you sit on it. Very clever, very technological. I can't even say the word. Technological. I can't even say it. Tech. Yeah, it's techno. Very complex. And <laughs> that's meant to cure the pain and the sores on my backside. Meaning I can get out of this bed for a bit longer. Which will be nice. Yeah, it will. Um, as for the problem down below. It is a flat hood jog without a spike. Um, the problems down below are a lot better than what they were yesterday. Oh, yesterday was a killer really was well we had a lovely kebab dinner tonight i couldn't eat all of it but the greedy woman did didn't you yes. yeah you ate it all that come all the way from bogner via just eat um and friday we're getting dinner delivered homemade dinner on the lovely people out the care shop have decided that we're eligible for a free dinner which will be very nice, along with the, uh, the food parcel to help Tracy out with her shielding. Um, not a lot else has happened, really. Oh, we did have the OT. She was going to try the new slidey material that goes on my banana board. Uh, but because of the bed sore, she thought she'd give it a miss. We had the nurse out this morning to help me with my daily ablutions, as normal. But the normal nurse, with the dressings for my backside, she wasn't even at work today, so I don't know what she was on about Wednesday and Friday. Uh, apparently, she's coming tomorrow, so hopefully she's got the dressings that I need. And she's ordered more from Boots or Lloyd's, the chemist. Um, Tracy will be with us very shortly. She's doing her ablutions at the moment. Not that you want to know about. She's getting rid of her kebab. Was that nice? Yeah. It was. You can come and say hello. Oh, Excuse these... me. Get down so people can see you. Hello. See, she's still here, and I've still got the beard. She hasn't, she hasn't taken the beard off yet, have you? No. Are you? If you want me to. You can have a go. Yeah, tomorrow morning. She's found a neat, a neat way of using one of your <laughs> gifts, uh, Lucy. She's going to use it as a beard trimmer catcher. <laughs> It'll work. We will see anyway. We'll do, uh, have to do some videoing of her trying to get this beard off of me, I think. That's the plan for tomorrow. Because tomorrow I've got the normal nurse and the dressing nurse coming out and that's it. Um, dinner, I haven't got a clue about. I know about me lunch. I've got a nice minced beef and onion slice in the fridge that's still got to be eaten. Before that goes out, I'm living date. And some vegetable soup. And some vegetable soup. If you want it. Food, shelf life, doesn't last very long, does it, these days? No. Only two or three days, which is uh, no good for uh, a family of four, or three even. I mean, how do you manage, Lucy? I know you get fresh eggs. Uh, I imagine you grow your own vegetables as well. We did. We, we have a nice, well, I say we, Tracy, the last few months, have a nice veg garden. Uh, we always grow vegetables, plenty of uh, tomatoes. We always grow plenty of tomatoes because you can do s so much with them. They're very versatile. We had quite a few potatoes. We did have potatoes. Um, blackberries. Blackberries. We didn't have any runner beans this year. No, we didn't grow any runner beans no. this year. I don't know why. We usually do. Um, peppers we planted. They didn't do too well. We did a few cucumbers. They yeah, grew quite well. Rhubarb. rhubarb. Yes. We always have loads of rhubarb, don't we? Yeah. We we like we like a rhubarb crumble. That's better. I mean, who doesn't? Everybody likes rhubarb crumble. Do you like custard? 
Or you like ice cream? Or 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 cream or both or all three? No. Oh yeah, you got to try it. You go. Anyway, um, yeah, that's about it for today. Unless you can think of anything. No. No, not not really. So whatever you're doing, you know the rule by now. Like, subscribe, share the hell out this video with your friends, and we'll speak to you tomorrow. Love you lots. Bye. Bye.